And also, that is the reason why they invented the temp save. Damn! Still another one, unbelievable. Well, that should blast damage him, I guess. Hopefully, no. Ugh. Oh yeah, great, yeah. It doesn't damage him when it's like two inches away, but it can be three feet away from me and I'll take a point of damage. Love it. Your logic, game, I... Ugh. No matter how long I study it, I will never understand your ways. Damn it, there's still another one out there. Unbelievable. Shit, I give up. I'm not even gonna try to count anymore. I've killed like ten already, so fuck it. Plus, we're just about out of power for our hammer. At least there's a couple quartz flasks laying around here. That that might come in handy. Oh, oh, look at that much-needed mana. Don't just want to run out and get it, though, because I don't want to wake anything up that I don't have to. I think I've gotten everything in this area, thank God. Oh, great. What do we have here? Bishops. Simple enough. Oh, look at that. Our first ninth of the puzzle. Damn. I do kind of remember this part. It's It looks complicated because, I mean, there's nine parts to the puzzle, but it's... If memory serves, it's not really that bad. I think you have to vis visit each of these chapels at least twice to get all of the, uh puzzle parts in them, but still, it's not really that bad, because once you go through the first time and you kill everything, basically your subsequent visit is just mop-up. Damn, that was close. Took me down to nine. Don't have any mana to waste on you, Mr. Slothar, so we're going to axe you to death. Oops. Hey, don't want to take any chances. I'd rather preserve my quartz flask if I can. So I'll wait for him to come to me now. There we go. Piece of cake. Excellent. Flechettes and green mana, but nothing else. Well... Hmm. I guess unless that door over... The other door near where we entered this level opened up, then... I think that's all we can actually accomplish here now, so... Make sure that nothing, that's, this door didn't open up again, and it didn't. Let's see here... Did she open for us? No! So that means we get to pick another chapel. But first, let's go back to the main hub. Alrighty, now these should light up. There we go, see? Each piece of the puzzle you solve, a picture lights up with, this, with the uh, corresponding level motif on it, I guess. Helps you keep track. Now, on to the next one. Should be the... Griffin Chapel, I do believe. I think that's what that is, a griffin. The Griffin Chapel. In the temple dedicated to the Winged Lion, an act of faith is required of all who would span the boundaries of life and death. Alrighty. Excellent. Mana right in front of us. I love that. Oh, great. Just what I needed. More serpents. Come on, Evan. You seem to want to have a conflict here, so I'll just take you out with my mighty iron fist there. Now. Oh, great. Let me deal with the weak miner. No count enemies here before I take out the big dogs, and damn, they just keep coming from over there. The other one actually wised up and tried to hide here, so where did he go? Well, well he didn't hide very well. I was about to say he actually uses his brain for once, or his brains, but no. Excellent, I can hit him through there. This means I can take them out, and they shouldn't be able to hit me. <laughs> Cheap tactic? Yes. Convenient? Very. Useful? Absolutely. One more? 
If you'd ever walk up to the bar, okay, they can shoot me out here. Whoops. I underestimated their abilities to shoot through tiny holes. If you'd walk up to the bars, I could get him. Come on. There you go. Just like so. Okay, see one lurking down there, and why did my hammer veer off to the... Why the hell is it going over there? Damn it, he's right there. There you go. Now you got it. <laughs> Hammers are getting a mind of their own here. That's... see anything else in the immediate area. Maybe there actually is something in there, though. In fact, I... Is that what I think it is? I can't... Yes, that's a serpent in there. Okay, that explains why the hammer was going over there. Again with the et... Come on, game. Whoops! Okay, did not want to use Quietus on him. I wanted to switch over to my uh, spiked gauntlets, but... Hmm, well, it's better than taking a shot in the face with their mace. Did not mean for that to rhyme, by the way. I hate those when they hide the bird eggs in those uh, va vases like that. Vases, vases, whatever you want to call them. I call them vases. Damn it. And here I am talking about pronunciation, and I, you know, died. Great. And I didn't, I wasn't smart enough to make a temp save after I killed these guys. So let's try this again, shall we? This time I'm expecting your dirty tricks, Mr. Bird. So I guess every one of these is going to be filled with a bird egg. Awesome. Well, that one's getting kind of close to being able to shoot outside here. If I could ever deal with all these guys, I could get to solving the puzzle and get out of here. Gotta say, I'm not really a big fan of the music that's going on here. Come on. Oh, there you go. Wow. He actually managed to throw a good grenade. A well-aimed grenade. What do you know? And naturally. Those should do something down there. Come on. No, of course not. I don't know how they managed to miss, but somehow they did. If there is a way, they will find it. Where are all these Etten coming from? I mean, it, I'm guessing that the other side of this room is just a copy of this one, basically. So there can't be that much area for the Etten to be at, so they're... You'd think that they'd all come at once, in other words, is what I'm saying, and not spread out over like a minute, like they are. See, look at this. At least there's no more here. Although we do have to deal with some more serpents, but... Using our trusty strategy, they should pose little to no threat. Now they're probably going to kill me because I said that, but still. And if I could actually hit them instead of the bar, it would, might help just a little bit. You're pissed. Well, damn. I guess I've hit each one about, what, twice now? There we go. Excellent. I just need to find out how to get the hell in there and get those items. Now, I do remember that being a... Whoops. I was not expecting that. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Well, they kind of closed in rather fast there. Where's the other one? There he is. Oh, you're gone. Whoops. <laughs> okay, let's try this one again. This time, instead of strafing into the path of the fireball, let's, you know, try and stay out of the way. Might help. I don't know, just a theory. Is that all of them in there? No, one of them didn't wake up. Alright, awesome. Maybe I can pitch a grenade in there and tackle him. Ricochet? Holy shit, it actually worked. <laughs> one of the few strategies that I've come up with here that actually worked. I'm rather proud of that fact. Well, kind of. I'm proud of the fact that it worked. Alright, I'm expecting you bastards now, so I'll nade your asses. Chew on that. The 
I get them both? No, but I got one of them. There we go. Easy peasy. Japanesey. Excellent, I'm another third of, or excuse me, another ninth of the puzzle. Damn it, I've got thirds on the brain here. Well, oh, those opened up, so what do we have in here? Excellent. A chaos device, a couple of flechettes, and I believe discs of repulsion were over here. Yep, yep, yep. Of course, we're full on those, so that doesn't really do us a whole lot of good, but still. Well, one of them hit. <laughs> hmm. Come on. Oh, man. You're gonna make me go down there, aren't you? You piece of shit, game. <laughs> 